Hey YouTube, welcome back to the show The Leopard Cat, where we are fun, sexy, fearless, independent, and always opinionated. I am here to do my very first story time. And I was debating about the which one I wanted to do, but I guess I should do um the one where I got a penny stuck in my mouth. I was like five or six years old. I might have even been seven. And um this video this story is funny. But is is kind of scary too because, I mean, I'm I'm sure anybody who's gotten some stuck in their mouth, you probably don't think you're gonna choke or anything. But this particular video, I was um back where my mom was living and we were over at her friend's house and I was playing in the room with her friend's daughter. She had two daughters who were older than me, and we were playing around and playing with toys and I saw a penny. And I took the penny and I put it in my mouth and then, I don't know why, put it in my mouth and I just kind of sucked it up like it was a piece of candy, sucked on it and it got stuck right at the top of my mouth, like right up there, like right, right where you, where it could like, you could almost swallow it right in the roof of my mouth. And I was just like, oh my God, what do I do? So I went to my mom and she was like, you know, what's going on? I was like, I got a penny. It's it stuck in my mouth. She was like, stop pointing. I'm like, it's in my mouth. And she looked. She was like, oh, my God. Oh, God. And she started freaking out. She tried to get, like, a knife or a spoon or something. And she I had my mouth open. She just looking. She's like, oh, my God. Don't. Don't breathe. Don't. Don't. Don't swallow. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. And they're freaking out. Like, oh, my God. How we get the penny out? So she goes and we go up to or we go down to our um, apartment building. And we go to our, our house and apartment. And we, um, she goes, put us on my clothes and we go to the emergency room. And everybody was just freaking out because they were like, oh my God, how do we get it out? We don't want her to swallow. She, she's so little. We don't want her to choke. Oh my God. So <laughs> we just freaking out. We were there for hours. And I'm just like, oh my God. She's like, don't swallow. Every five minutes, she's like, don't swallow. <laughs> like it was just freaking me out. So we finally get seen by the doctor. They put me up on the little table. And the nurse, I have my mouth open. She's just like, oh my God, I don't know how to get it out. She has on gloves and everything. And then this other doctor comes in. I don't know if he was a doctor, who he was. But he looked at my mom and said, really, is that all it is? He takes his hand, his hand, his finger, and just goes in my mouth like this. Gets it out and then puts it in my mouth and the penny comes out. And my, I was relieved, but my mother had a fit. She cussed him out, called him every name in the book. Said how he was nasty, how he could have had his hand in his ass, and how she was just so offended that he would stick his finger in my mouth with no gloves. And he was just like, I was just trying to help. She was so mad and furious. I remember her dragging my hand out of there. And I was leaving the um hospital, which was like right around the corner from us. Ironically, oh my God, it was just... It was scary, but it was still comical because my all I can remember is my mom cussing him out, calling him all types of names. I mean, she was so furious. You know, my mom didn't take any mess. Like, me and her just alike. Um, God rest her soul. But, yes, we, we were... She was freaking out because she was like, you could have had your hand in your behind. How could you do this? And I was just relieved to have the penny out of my mouth. <laughs> Anyway, this is my very first story time. Hope you like it. Thumbs up the video. Also, subscribe if you want to see more. Share it on Facebook and Twitter. Follow me on Instagram and Twitter at that Virgo Vixen. I will be doing more of these. And tell me if you ever got a penny stuck in your mouth. Leave a comment below. And um, I'll see you in my next video. Peace.